Karibu sana our viewers. This is the Tubonge Talk Show as always. This is at PCA Tome online page. Thank you for coming on. I'm your host Chege Chosen on all my social media. If you go to YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Zote ni Chege Chosen. Thank you so much for always being there to support us and to watch us. And we appreciate your viewing. Make sure you subscribe. That subscription goes a long way to add the family and others and help us make more and more content. I'm not alone today. We want to have a conversation right here. And so I want to bring on the guest that we have. He'll tell you his name and what he's doing. And then we dive in to the conversation of the day. Karibu sana. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm. So, hi viewers. Uh, my name is Mongai Dennis. Uh, I'm an engineer student uh, on electrical. Uh, I'm a drummer, I'm a bassist, I'm a vocalist. Uh, I do a lot. I'm quite blessed uh, uh, with great and a lot of things to do. Yeah. Awesome. Jack of many trades and master of all. <laughs> awesome. By the way, uh, uh, we, uh, w what can you say about, because today we want to have a conversation about the journey of a man. Because there has been a lot of cry about the boy child and who the boy child is. And so we want just to delve into uh, you yourself. Many people don't even believe that young men, there are young men who can love God. How do you even balance, you know, you're a student and you're in engineering, but at the same time, you serve God. Uh, what inspires you and what can you tell the young men uh, out there? So, uh, for me, I'll say it's not easy and it's easy. First, uh, bring out what you know and get to understand what is known. Then get a mentor who can help you through the journey because you can uh, grow up knowing, uh, mon example, Monome mm Aliangi. -hmm. That is the norm. Mm -hmm. But in life, you have to clearly understand why people say that and is it right or wrong? Mm -hmm. But when you understand the positive side about it, mm -hmm then it's easier for you to go on. How I balance? I categorize myself and get to understand my weakness and also my strength and uh, my strong sides of life. In this point, uh, taking engineering, there's a lot of mathematics mm -hmm. as well known. And so I have to give it more time because studies will be for a short time, then I'm done, then music shall be there. So I have to give it time. Kila kitu na time yake. Yeah. And um, what can you say, for example, in the, what are the opportunities that people can take up, you know, as, uh, as young people and even as young men, that they can start growing themselves? Because one of the questions that young people have is how do you discover yourself? And maybe you can give us your own personal journey of how you discovered yourself and the opportunities you're able to take up. At what point did you start knowing I have this talent and this talent? So uh, for me, discovering myself was quite tough. I've grown up in a very wild and... Uh, maybe say very thoughtful place where people fight all the time. So I just decide to do what is right. And as you've asked, uh, there are times that, that come in life, you have to focus and decide now this is what to do. Personally, I, I know I'm blessed in observation and I can clearly observe something and get to do it. It may not take a short time, but I'll definitely do it. An example, I, back in high school, I told a guy to teach me how to play drums. Mm. That was in Form 1. Mm. So this guy came out with a negativity of telling me, you know what, the way you look, man, you know nothing, you can get nothing. And I was like, thank you. Why? Because I take negativity as a positivity and make it a stare of my success. Mm. And so in Form 1, I went home, I, would be, I became a good friend of earphones mm. and form two, this guy was just some new student to me, mm. just like a teacher. Mm. But it's not by me. I had to sacrifice something mm. and also to tell God, you know what? I proclaim and get this 
nime nimeamua in yangu and as they say the, the the tongue has power and i claimed it god gave it to me wow so you just go for what you believe go for it and it will happen it's easier mm. to be a go getter yeah and also mm. get beware of who you walk around with mm. if you walk with five fools mm. and you're the sixth there then mm. you're the sixth fool mm. you walk with five wise men mm. you're the sixth wise man mm. yeah. you talk about family challenges and one of the things is that we are, we all come from somewhere and there are those things that hold us back from our family maybe you can point out what are some of these things that have been a challenge and how were you able to overcome you can mention one or two things that you feel these were struggles in my family uh, and this is how i came out of them uh-huh mostly as known um, i'm just uh, an introvert to people i don't know and i'm an extrovert to people i know mm. so one challenge uh my dad used to be very very wild on me and he could do anything to those people who are wild mm. so for me i was like but by well do you mean violent exactly. or just harsh violent yeah, okay while he could do anything okay. as long as okay. he's satisfied mm. Mm. and i was like uh, i was very tender mm. and seeing him doing everything i was like you know what i don't like this mm. i hate this mm. so the moment i hate something mm. it encourages me mm. to get to something good that i deserve to know mm. and so i tried getting to some friends of mine who i knew their parents are well stable and i could ask mm. how they know so i thought parents are stable mm. until i got to understand it's happening all over it's upon you to choose what is good for you mm. and what is not good for you mm. so after talking to many people mm. i had the knowledge of do not just look on the negativity of people that is there mm. look at the positivity and even um, in the midst of their negativity yeah. look for something wise mm. that they are doing yeah. and just follow the good path the negative mm. side will definitely mm. get out nika uchukue chai yenye ina sukari si wengi watakunywa yes but if you put some sugar inside there mm. many people will drink it so it depends on how the challenges that are there how you're going to take them up exactly. uh, and i believe that is very 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 powerful um what can you mention about um uh, being a young person and loving god and now on the issue now of even things like relationships there are people who say that a dio ununue gari lazima gari iende road test <laughs> so, yeah. so now you're a young man who loves god and uh, and people are saying eh ndio mimi nipate mtu eh i go marry eh why don't we do a road test eh, some of these things so there are all these th- things that people can say uh, what can you say about such your path determines what you will receive on the way mm kipitia barabara ya ma maram Mhm exactly yeah tutapatana na mawe vumbi kupitia lami super highway yenye imejengwa juzi it's just a smooth walk aha choose your ways and your life mm. for me i'm young yes very young but i look old mm. and na ni kweli they say barabara yes lazima u test mm. but one thing i'll just tell uh, people out there to know you might test and test the wrong vehicle which mm. will lead you to an accident mm. it's written in the bible if you cannot hold it mm. then beware about it mm. peter said that my god the people uh-huh. <laughs> so yeah if you know you cannot handle it mm. wait for the time and mm. as always god can give you self control mm. just ask it's written that you do not have for you have not asked mm ukitisha unapewa yeah and god who is he he's our father mm. in heaven kiuliza mm. anantupatia yeah so usi si test enda pole pole amazing so you believe in yourself and what you want to do in life and go for it now what are the, so i want you to look back start with the moment your your worst moment in life and now look at the the greatest moment in your life so just mention that so that when you talk about the boy child today they are going to look at a champion who has seen a bad day and a good day but at the end of the day they are here pursuing their engineering and pursuing their life what is that point in your life that you are so low and now what is that point in your life where you are so excited what did you do or who did you meet or what event happened yeah you can mention uh huh 
my worst moment my worst moment has been when families were colliding mm. for about i held the pain for nine years mm. down the line mm. and uh, between the journey i don't know how it happened but success. Mm-hmm. I went to this place mm-hmm. back then and mm-hmm. it was a church. I decided to sing. Mm-hmm. And here came, I found this guy who was called Chosen. Mm-hmm. And kidogo kidogo to me pigabari. Kama rose liskizana. Then since then, yes. from the bad side where I was Ukiniguza, yeah. it is a trigger. I'll do any, anything around me mm-hmm. will just flow on you because ni megro kwa violence okay but when i crossed paths to this side i need mm-hmm. atasi ku struggle it just mm-hmm. came mm-hmm. this guy has taken me paths till today okay he might not know but indirectly he does something he mm-hmm. talks about something i recall okay this happened this happened mm-hmm. so i'll tell everything to prayer mm-hmm. just tell god you know mm-hmm. people say maombi kubwa mm-hmm. Ndiyo baraka mingi. Oh, yeah, yeah. Waking up in the morning and saying, God, give me protection mm. today. Mm. You will go and come back. Mm. Something simple. Because God is very simple. Awesome. So that's, how, that's the worst moment and how you overcame it. The yes. best moment? The best moment yes. is when I met that guy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so ni mishika ni shazote juu it was a lot. When your life turned around, exactly. out of, so out of the pain through the joy. Exactly. Okay. Uh, amazing. I just want you to say one final word to someone watching who is pursuing their dreams, pursuing their life and that encouragement you might want to tell them. Easy. Do not be a slave of your past, but be the pioneer of your future. Mm being a pioneer of your future is getting those who have been inspired to inspire you so that you can inspire others wow. for me i say inspire before you expire mm-hmm. and expiring is definitely kukufa mm-hmm. so if you've been inspired inspire somebody if your past can lag you behind mm-hmm. just know you're a pioneer of your future and it is easier to flow and every time a single player simple prayer mm-hmm. a single player and a simple player mm. ronaldo i'm not a fan of football mm. but kwa kwa kikuyu umetumiza played prayer but uh, <laughs> we'll try to melewa kidogo mali <laughs> i got to understand about <laughs> that guy because me <laughs> in sports side i'm more of a basketballer all right i realized that guy after okay. checky him yeah. being a single player okay and with a single prayer yes he has grown okay yeah don't be a slave to your past a single player with a single prayer i made it i i, did, I was not sure i'll make it so thank you <laughs> thank you so much daddy for your time we'll have another time have a conversation talk about different things talk about even relationships talk about leadership talk about universities and what goes there education talk about money by the way that's one of the topics that need to come up here into bonge talk show that we can talk about the christian perspective towards money towards uh, relationships towards career and i know all these and much much more can only be right here at to bonge talk show thank you so much for watching this to uh, the pca dome online page thank you for watching leave a comment make sure you like i'm your host chege chosen until next time god bless you bye